Here's the field for race number nine. One is Sensational Sherry. Owned by Howard Farvel, driven by Charlie Conrad. Two is Noble Dancer, owned by Terry Zuber, Mike Roth, and Patty Muller, driven by Mike Roth. Three is Beretta, owned by Mike Metters. Brad Hanner is the rangeman. Number four is Rosie Scooter, owned by Richard Stevens, Sal Nacera, Jeff Fout will be aboard. Five is Johanna, owned by Bob Griffith with Hugh Beatty. Six is Ultra Sabra, owned by Richard Ward, Paul Wonder, Mike Wilder in the bike. Seven, Kelly's Camaro has been scratched. Six, number eight, Romy Ann, owned by Fred Bates and driver Dave Rankin. He'll be in the sulky. Scratch number seven, Kelly's Camaro, post time in five minutes. Field four, race nine at the gate, moving through the clubhouse turn. Field four, race nine at the gate. Field is now in motion. And there they go. They're off and pacing Johanna. Middle of the racetrack for the lead. Rosie Scooter is there, and so is the big mare, Moretta. They're down the back stretch. Sensational Sherry is now fourth. Driving up on the far outside, Ultra Sabra from fifth. As they move midway on the turn, Noble Dancer and Romian likes this so far. And we have a total fiesta going to the quarter mile. Paul Moretta quickly darts from between horses, puts everybody else in behind her. And she is a huge filly. She's going to get the lead by the opening quarter in 27 and 3. Racing past the stands, Moretta will go tonight on the front end. Moretta under Bradley Hanners leads away by a length and a half. Rosie Scooter the Danger in second. Past the stands, Ultra Sabra third. Sensational Sherry is racing fourth. She'll come to the outside. Noble Dancer is going to stay in. Here comes Romy Ann to the outside. Johanna, who tried to leave quickly, got shuffled back to seventh. They're at the half mile pole. Bouncing right along, it's Moretta. Driving up on the outside, Sensational Sherry, and she's getting that Rindy Macho Man Savage journey now, looking for a Slim Jim. And they're at the half mile pole in 58 and 2. They're down the back stretch. Moretta continues to lead the way. Sensational Sherry at her wheel disc in second. Rosie Scooter skims the pylons third. Better take a long look at Romy Ann. She's caught the bus around the far turn. Ultra Sabra, Noble Dancer up on the outside, and Johanna there, hub to hub by three quarters and a fast 127 and one. They'll pace the turn and come on home. Under Bradley Hanners, Moretta continues to lead the way. Sensational Sherry right alongside in second. Romy Ann with the late kick on the far outside. They're inside the final eighth of the mile. Being set down and under the whip, it's Moretta. Romy Ann on the outside, bids her good night. Romy Ann in between horses, Moretta. Rosie Scooter up the rail. Ultra Sabra on the far outside for the deuce. Romy Ann to the wire. Here comes Jenna Fisher, winner of tonight's ninth race, number eight, Romy Ann. Going right up the class ladder. Four year old Bay Mare by Falcon Elmahurst out of Fan Ann. Owned by Fred Bates and Dave Rankin of Mount Perry and Thornville. Reigned and trained by Dave Rankin. Covering them out here in 156 and 2 in a lifetime best. 8, Romy Ann. The winner of tonight's ninth race. It is official. Windows are open on tonight's 10th race. Mike Wilder driving number t 2, Amy Q. Mike Wilder driving 2, Amy Q. No changes in the 11th, 12th, or 13th races. Four more to go here on this Friday night card. We've already started late night California for our thoroughbred fans at Golden Gate in Hollywood. And we'll have the first eight from my old friends in Sacramento Capital Racing at Cal Expo. Wall to wall action tonight, plus advanced betting on tomorrow's Preakness. We'll be here till about quarter to two for some late night harness and thoroughbred racing action. 8 6 exact, $145. 145 even. Trifecta 486.80. Next post, 1042.